What's up guys, Anton here at DPR. This week we've hatched these amazing head puzzles. So why not do a video about them? This week, it's all about puzzle. If you're ready, let's jump right into that. So these two right here are the two most stacked babies from the clutch. Basically the pairing was a pastel orange dream puzzle to a Mojave vanilla spot nose. So everything is 100% head for puzzle. And these two are exactly the same thing. They are orange dream vanilla Mojave spot nose, 100% head puzzle. This is a pair. This little one here is the male and this one's the female. They're both going to be holdbacks. These are the most stacked head puzzle that we've ever made. Definitely amazing combos. Uh, Mojave and puzzle works amazingly well. Spot nose does as well. OD does as well. And vanilla is just like the cherry on top of the sundae. This is just pure madness when it comes to how stacked these animals are. Uh, and I absolutely love the visual of them. The head stamp is truly astonishing with that very clear orange color and then the vanilla just really really smooths everything on top of the snake these two snakes are absolutely amazing so while we've hatched these i really wanted to show you um the importance of having good males so we're going to check back our breeder male and we're going to talk a little bit more about this so this boy here, this pastel orange dream puzzle that we got uh, two years ago from Al at Vivid Pythons. This is by far the snake that was our best investment to this date. Um, this male just made more than 500% uh, in profit what he was paid for. So this is just completely ridiculous. Um, and I've, I've careful because uh, it's a puzzle and they bite. Uh, um, I've talked about this in the past, but uh, I really, really wanted to have Orange Dream inside of my puzzle mail. So I paid more than $4,000 extra just to get OD inside of a puzzle mail. Um, I had some pastel puzzle available for pretty cheap, but I really wanted to have that gene. And now it has paid off more and more. Uh, it's just crazy. Now, most of my babies that I made uh, have OD. I was extremely lucky to hit so many OD head puzzle combo. Um, and by selling some OD head puzzle combo, I've made my extra 4,000 more than once. It's just crazy uh, the amount I made with that mail. And that being said, I always, I always can't stress enough how important it is to get the right genes inside of your, uh, inside of your breeder males, especially if you're jumping inside of a new project. If I just went for the easy route and took a simple pastel puzzle, I would have completely missed on all those OD head puzzle girls that I have right now. And I'm going to show you a few of them and you're just going to understand the importance of how uh, buying a male with specific genes that you want to work inside of a project is important. So this female is one of the holdbacks that we've kept from last year. This is a orange dream vanilla pastel Mojave head puzzle. Uh, obviously that snake would have been great without OD, but just having this animal as an OD, this as a visual puzzle would be just incredible. Uh, Mojave translates so, so well with puzzles. It's crazy how uh, the, the Mojave puzzles are just phenomenal looking animals. So this female is gonna be uh, key in the future to create amazing combos. I absolutely love the look of that girl. She's extremely mean also. Uh, this is a Orange Dream Mojave spot nose head puzzle. Uh, just the best jeans to work with. Basically, this is the vanilla. Uh, this is a version without vanilla of the babies I just produced. Um, we decided to held her back last year because obviously the jeans are way too cool. Um, so this is another one of our uh, OD head puzzle female that we're raising. Now we're on to my, well, one of my favorite head puzzle from last year. This is Orange Dream Vanilla Spot Nose Head Puzzle. Um, she's gonna be key to make some crazy looking super OD puzzle. Um, vanilla is just a cherry on the sundae, as I said before, but Spot Nose in there too is just amazing. I love on its own the look of that. It's extremely dark where the blacks are. It's extremely dark, contrasted, a lot of light. Um, puzzle is a lighter gene also. So basically that's why it works so well with OD. They don't tend to brown out as much, um, let's say as clown. So this female here is gonna be epic in the future. I just can't wait to start uh, doing some planning and having a male for her. And I would say this one is by far my favorite OD head puzzle that we made last season. This is the Orange Dream. Bungo Mojave, 100% head puzzle. The look of that snake is just phenomenal. And I cannot wait to see the puzzle pattern going on those, you know, little spots that goes all along the side of that snake and mess up the back dorsal. I'm extremely excited to see what Bungo will look like uh, in the puzzle project. 
this female is, I would say, the snake I am most excited that we've produced in our in, in our puzzle project um, last season. This girl is just truly breathtaking. Um, I wanted to make something similar to this, but with Cypress. Unfortunately, none of the girls went. I really want to have that OD Cypress head puzzle project going on. Um, I also have, I'm not going to show her today, but I also have the pastel OD lace head puzzle that we made this year. This is also going to be a crazy girl for the future. Uh, it's just endless the amount of uh, potential we have with those OD head puzzle girls. Just to give you a little bit of an idea of what an OD puzzle combo would look like, this is a female we got at the beginning of the year from Cal Frost. This is the Orange Dream Enshi Leopard Puzzle. And if you remember her on our first video we've posted on our channel, she has grew so much. She is one of the best eater we have here. Uh, we have really good hopes of breeding her in no time. We still don't really know what exactly we have going for her. Uh, we might be able to make some double recessive uh, visual puzzle. That would be crazy. I'm not saying what right now because we're keeping that under wrap, but definitely if we can hit the male out of that project, she would, he would go definitely straight to her. Uh, if not, we might have some other options. Even that little male we made uh, that we showed at the beginning of the, of the video, that OD Mojave Spot Nose Vanilla Head Puzzle. Would you imagine that? Like a super OD Mochi Vanilla Leopard Spot Nose Puzzle. That's just way too crazy to imagine. Uh, this girl is definitely a favorite of ours. Um, and it just goes to show that how, when you get the right genes, how it can affect your collection in the future. Now from that extra 4,000 to get that OD, I have a whole army of OD head puzzle to work with. And it means that in four or five years, I'll be making some OD and super OD combo puzzle that I've never been seen before. Uh, so I'm just setting myself with that mail, um, with that extra cash involved, I'm just setting myself for you know years of greatness ahead with that super OD and OD puzzle project. And this girl is just a perfect add on top. So guys, I really hope you enjoyed seeing those girls from last year, this new clutch, the breeder and the new additions. And um, I'm just gonna wrap it up again by saying that if you're wondering if you should spend a little more for an animal that has a gene you really, really want, let's say you wanna work in clown and you wanna work hurricane clown, but you know, yellow belly is that little thing that makes it pop even more and the yellow belly hurricane clown is a little bit more expensive. I say, go ahead and go get it because that will just show in every single clutch you'll have. It is so, so important to have males with genes that you really, really like. Uh, and this pastel OD puzzle is just like, you know, it was the best investment for me at that time. Um, by the way, I'm letting it out. I don't know if someone's gonna have one or know someone that has something available, but I am looking for a new breeder visual puzzle male. Um, obviously with OD to go with all of those girls, but I really want to have something like yellow belly. So a OD yellow belly puzzle, they can have other things uh, involved, but I really wanted those two genes, aren't dream yellow belly and puzzle as a visual male. If anyone has one, knows someone to breed one or knows one available somewhere else, let me know. Uh, and on this, comment down below, uh, which of those hold back female is your favorite. On this, we'll see you next week. We have crazy dark night clutch to cut in two days. I am beyond thrilled. Cheers and stay